Now, today's top stories and Power of 5 weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hello, I'm Danita Harris. Here's a look at today's top stories. Summit County's first ever female sheriff takes office today. Voters made history back in November, electing Candy Fothery into office. She started her police career almost 30 years ago in the Lakemore Police Department as its first female police officer. She was also the first female Summit County Sheriff's deputy to attend the FBI National Academy. Free food, including produce and frozen meat, is available today in Lorain County. The Second Harvest Food Bank is hosting a drive through food distribution at Ely Stadium in Elyria from 2 until 4 this afternoon. You need to register on the food bank's website to be eligible. Volunteers will be putting food in your car, so make sure the trunk is empty before arriving. The Halloran Park Ice Skating Rink in Cleveland opens for the season today. While the pandemic delayed the opening date, the extra time allowed the city to make some improvements to the rink, including adding penalty boxes and painting hockey lines on the ice. The rink is open Monday through Friday from noon until 730. It is free to get in. Ice skate rentals cost a dollar each. The Summit County Metro Parks is celebrating its 100th anniversary this year. The park system is asking the community to plant centennial trees at homes, schools and businesses as a way to mark the milestone. Now for a look at your weather, here's meteorologist Brian Shaw. Cloudy skies here in northeast Ohio. We've had the occasional burst of a little bit of light snow in some spots. You can see that accumulating on the camera here in Menor, where there's just been a little bit of light snow, some flurries, and then it melts. Uh, mostly just wet roads in those spots that are dealing with a little bit of that light snow. Much of it not even really showing up on radar. We really have to zoom in to actually see some of that moisture coming in off the lake and the burst of that little bit of light snow. This cold front to the west is going to move in for tonight and tomorrow. And that's going to give us another chance of a little bit of light snow, but I don't really expect that to amount to all that much. It's just going to be more of a visual. We might get a quick coating on uh, some of the grassy surfaces, but that would really be about it. Unfortunately, we're not going to see much of that clearing to the south and west. Unlikely that we're going to see much of any sunshine really for the next week. It's going to stay pretty dreary for us. So the occasional flurries for today, temperatures going to be in the mid 30s. Temperatures for later on tonight are going to get a little cold as we drop down into the upper 20s and low 30s. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.